Hi everyone, welcome to my channel. My name is Lisa, and today I am stuffing my cash envelopes for February paycheck number one. So I have gone to the bank and I have a lot of money here to stuff, which I'm really excited about. So let's go ahead and count this so that you guys know how much I'm stuffing. 100, 200, 300, 400, 500, 600, 50, 700, 750, 800, 850, 900, 950, 1,000. Sorry, my dog was chewing my cord there. I think that was 1,000. 20, 40, 60, 80, 1,100. 20, 40, 60, 80, 1,200. 20, 40, 60, 80, 1300, 20, 40, 60, 80, 1400, 10, 15, 16, 17, 18. So uh, quite a bit to stuff today, which I'm really excited about. I got paid on Friday, today is Saturday, and I was chomping at the bit to go get my cash out and do my cash envelope stuffing so that I could you know, go to the grocery store and do all the things I need to do. I don't know if I can get all this on here where you can see it, but we'll do our best. Okay, so I am using this little binder, got it from Amazon, um, and I have my envelopes in here that I created myself, and I've got several categories that I'm gonna be adding to this week. We're gonna start with the cleaning ladies. So uh, what is today? February the 3rd. And we're going to add $100. And that's going to give me a balance of 100 because they did come last paycheck. And I did give them all of the money that was in there. So there's $100 for cleaning ladies. Then I have groceries. And we're adding... $100 to groceries today. And that's going to give me a balance of 100 because I spent everything that was in there. And for groceries, I'm going to do all 20s. So 20, 40, 60, 80, 100. And I didn't mention this, but if you're new here, I am 49 years old. I live in central Arkansas. Um, I am renting a house and my daughter lives with me. She is 26 years old and she does contribute to the household. This is just from my paycheck. And also, actually it's not true, this is from mine and from hers because she gave me $500 yesterday. Um, all right, so gas is going to get $20 and that's gonna leave me a balance of 20 because I did spend what was in there. So we've got 20 for gas. Now I work from home and uh, so I don't have to commute to an office and uh, which is good because I save on gas. So that's why my gas is so low. And then for the electric, I had 150 budgeted out of my check and then $100 out of my daughter's check. So 250 is what I'm gonna add to electric. So, and I went to the bank and I asked them for like specific denominations and they didn't give them to me. They gave me a bunch of 50s, which I wasn't expecting, but that's okay. So 50, 100, 50, 200, and 50. And that's for electric. Then we have the internet bill. And internet is $108. And so I'm setting aside half from my paycheck, which is going to be $55. It should be $54, but they didn't give me the right amount of change. So we're just going to have to make it work. So here is a 55 for the internet. And then 
I am going to set aside for rent. Let me see if there's anything else. Oh, fur babies. I do need to put money into fur babies. Let's see what we've got in here right now. 20, 40, 60, 80, 120. So I need $100 in fur babies. So 20, 40, 60, 80, 100. Daisy, my puppy is getting fixed next Wednesday on the 7th and I needed $200 for her spay. And 20 is a little wiggle room in case they, um, they were wrong about the amount. Okay, so I think everything else, let me see if I have, I should have 800 for rent. At least I hope. Let's, well, obviously I have something other than 800, but 100, 200, 300, 400, 500, 600, 20, 40, 60, 87, 20, 40, 60, 80, 90, 91, 92, 93. So I am going to take 20 back from fur babies and just leave the 100 and I'll put the rest of what's in here. So let's count this again. Cause I definitely need to, I'm gonna pay the rent for March today, February the 3rd. 100, 200, 300, 400, 500, 600, 20, 40, 60, 80, 700, 20, 40, 60, 80, 800. Okay, so that leaves me with $14. And I think what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna put this in the rent envelope, but I'm gonna text my, um, landlord and ask her to come over and get some money. So this 10, I'm going to put into fur baby. So that'll give me 110. So still have a little bit of wiggle room. Woo! Holy moly. My holder just went down. Goodness. Okay. So what I have left over is $3 and you all know I don't spend ones or fives except for the 55 for the uh, internet bill. <laughs> That's different, but this was left over from last paycheck, and so the three dollars is going to go into my clear acrylic bank for savings. So the goal is I need to get something down in there to smush that down. I was using a ruler, but I don't have it handy. That way I could continue to stuff money down in here. I'm gonna have to make this work, which is kind of why I was folding it the way I was, but I would say we're doing pretty good. We just started adding to this not too long ago, and we have a good bit of money in there. I'm not keeping track of how much I'm putting in here because I don't wanna know. I wanna be surprised along with all of you at the end of the year. So instead of trying to do like individual savings challenges, I'm just throwing everything in a clear um, bank that has to be broken to get into. And then I have 50, 64 cents to add in here as well. So that's it. So I was able to add a little bit to my bank, stuff all my envelopes, and uh, I think that's gonna be it for this video. Um, Again, this was my cash envelope stuffing for February paycheck number one. Thank you guys so much for watching. Thank you for supporting my channel, and I hope you guys have a great day or night wherever you're at. Bye!